Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to a weekend of my life vlog. Sav and I are on the rooftop. We ordered Chick fil A. I'm wearing a really um, fashion forward outfit today. Very bright. Had to grab my. I almost said shades, and then it reminded me of Miley Cyrus, like 23. You know, back oh in that my phase. Gosh, yeah. yeah. Showing you guys a little Chick fil A haul. Hmm. This is mine. I got a breakfast sandwich. We both got hash browns. I didn't even get chicken minis this time. Yeah, I was about to say. Because I'm just really hungry and I needed a chicken sandwich. Chicken minis. Okay. Comment below your Chick-fil-A order. What Chick-fil-A sauce you get. I'm a Chick-fil-A sauce girl. Used to be a Polynesian girl back in the day. Did you know that about me? Uh-uh. Yeah, it was like middle school. Had my coffee. I've been trying to upload yesterday's vlog for like the longest time and it's been really annoying. A guy is coming in an hour to come check and do the, chick the chicken. The, the kitchen chicken. remodel <laughs> to give me a quote. So after that, we're gonna go to the Dallas Farmer's Market where there's like pumpkins and it's festive and cute. So that is our plan for today. A very cute fall festive day. I haven't even watched like Halloween Town or any of those movies or gotten those sugar cookies. Actually, yeah, I did, I did but I just didn't make them. You know the sugar cookies? Yeah. With the, I need to do a lot of things. I'm ready for the day. It is, um, it was really cold this morning and yesterday. It's supposed to be like high of 60 something today. So I don't think, hi Sav, I don't think um, the jacket will stay on, but I really wanted to wear it. My Uggs are out. Um, it's called fashion, look it up people. This is not the bag I should be wearing today. I should be wearing my Balenciaga bag, the crossbody. Yeah. Should I change into that one? Yeah. But I have my camera, so that's what's annoying. I'm just gonna have to keep this one because I mean, it looks fine. But the other one would look better. However, I need this size so that I can put my camera in it. Like, it definitely doesn't look as cute as the other one would. But anyways, um, I'm not having the best few days. By, I mean, yesterday I just had horrible cramps and I'm just like really tired. Realized why I was so tired. We're gonna go to Starbucks. We're going to the farmer's market, which will be very exciting. Oh my gosh, what is on my lens? Sorry about that, guys. Okay, I think I got off, but anyways, my outfit. This, um, both of these, no, this is Aritzia, this is H&M, favorite jeans, Princess Polly, Uggs. What about you, Steph? Want to do an OOTD? Um, so this is from Urban Outfitters. Cute. I don't know where the leggings are from. And then these are Nike shoes. Cute. I kind of want to go to Urban today a little bit. Okay. Oh my gosh, Steph is wearing makeup. I'm just and not used to you wearing makeup. And I did my hair. And you did your hair. It's a big day for me. Sav like literally didn't, you didn't wear makeup until like a year or two ago. I didn't start wearing makeup until I was 20. Yeah. And even at that, it's like pretty rare. Yeah. I do makeup, I've noticed this, I did it this morning where I wasn't gonna wear makeup today. And then I was mm -hmm. on the phone with my dad and then I went in and I just do my makeup while I'm on the phone as like a habit. I don't know why, cause I don't always do that. Anyways, we're gonna go head out. I do have a new drink I wanna try. That's why I wanna go to Starbucks and my energy levels have just not been, um, at their peak, you know, like they could be better. So, oh, also, okay, another thing. I was deep in thought today. Okay. More people came to give me an estimate for my kitchen, so I do need to go pick out slabs and stuff when I finally got an address. But this, okay, let me see if I can explain this to you guys. So this bar is going, this is gonna be extended into a bar, so there's gonna be bar stools. And then this is also gonna be extended. It leaves less room for like when you're going through here, but my Christmas tree is supposed to be here, which is already gonna be big. No, I think it's still gonna be fine though. Cause like, I'll just go around. Oh yeah, you just went backwards, Sav. Awesome. You're so close. I tried. Do you want us to light up? Yes. Okay. Guys, it's so, I gave you the flashy one. You can't really tell cause it's not dark, but we're gonna go take Fitz out really quick and then leave. Wow, you this does look so Thank you. This does look so good. So I'm trying Sav's new drink, which she got from a friend. But it's a grande cold brew cinnamon almond milk foam with two pumps, cinnamon syrup, and a single shot of espresso. Yes. It's really quite the name. It's a mouthful. It's a mouthful to say the least. Am I supposed to be mapping you? Um, I can do it. Okay, good. 
Because you know when you just like are leaving somewhere and you realize that you probably you don't just. Know where you're going. Yeah, you have no idea where you're going. We're gonna go to the farmer's market. All right, guys, trying my drink. Oh, it's really good. Yeah. It is like, I wish you could, really like, good. actually, like, really stir it. I know, we don't have, like, I, mean, I forgot to ask, but. Okay, I'm gonna hold this up so you guys can screenshot it if you guys wanna try it. But it's really good. Look this at is how really pretty. Stressful. This is really stressful. Oh, no, you can't park no, there. I can't even <laughs> park like that. We've already decided for soft rubios. Like, I've never actually been to this one, but that just makes me so happy. Love. So beautiful. Well, like my sister parks like to the left. Yeah, I was gonna turn left. You know, yeah. so I think maybe we're getting somewhere, but I guess we'll see. It looks really cute. However, um, there's no parking. So we decided we're going to North Park. I haven't been to North Park since February. Yeah, yeah. February. It has been so long. I cannot believe it. I just had like a really weird, Can not you like turn right. Yeah. Okay. Not like deja vu moment, but like. How is it already October and it's actually almost November? I don't like that. So guys, rate 2020 down below. I would love to hear your high, your low. I'm actually serious. And what we are, the general consensus, because personally it's not been my best year, but there have been good things, like fits in my house. You know? What about you? Great song. I surgery. Yes, Sam just had surgery, so it hasn't really been her year. <laughs> yeah, it, it, nothing's really gone well for me this year. Yeah, that's yeah, like, true. And school. I basically <laughs> like had two breakups. Yeah, we made it to North Park. Love. This one smells really good too. This is so good for gifts though, because it's choose your fragrance, then you can personalize the label, and then you it wraps it as your gift. Like it's so good. We made it to wash the sun side, the shower jelly. Oh. It just is probably the same scent, but it's not the it spray. We are just looking around, guys. Everything looks cute. Boo. Very festive. Three people. So excited. Not sure what's going on here. We'll keep you guys posted on what I what I gather. This is crazy. So <laughs> what Sam said literally right before I hit record is <laughs> the most women statues ever assembled in one location at one time. In 2021, with 122 contemporary female STEM professionals and role models. Oh, that's actually really cool. So then you can like scan probably to get more information. And it's in Maybelline Super Stay Matte. Oh, that's cool. You go, you go girl. <laughs> Loves hanging with you guys today. What did you, oh, hi, what's up? I really like the outdoor voices at North Park, guys. In case anyone was wondering, J. Crew, my new pajamas. Guys, we've been wanting to go to anthropology all day. I woke up in a weird, sad mood, and anthropology is really making me feel better. So beautiful. <laughs> wow, sad. That's a big step. <gasps> beautiful. Oh my god, look at this. Wait. That's so cute. Those frames. This is literally my dream. Everything is fixed. Oh my god, wait, that is so cute. Look at how cute that is. Guys, this is such a great gift. Candyland as like a book, and that's how you store your games. Then you open it and it's a game. That is so much better than storing them as like the hockey ones. They have a... That is so cute. And Monopoly. I love this. That's really good for my mom's lake house, actually. And you can just like sit on that. It's my favorite tomato basil soup there though. Well, Madeline, guys, we're at Anthro, and I love this for my couch because it's brown and black. Like, it's really cool. So, it really kind of brings in my whole house. So, I think I'm gonna get it. Yeah. All right, guys, we went into Aritzia. It's a really small one here, but they have TNA, which is all I care about. And then, well, actually, I love some of these best. We didn't look too much. And then the new parachute home, I guess they closed the one on Knox Anderson and then they opened one in North Park. And I like that one a lot. I like the new one better. Just giving you guys updates. <laughs> we got crab bisque for lunch. It looks really good. Also, it's like the perfect day. It's cold. We're having soup. We're having soup. It's really exciting. We are leaving North Park. Picked up a few things. Had some lunch. We're going to stop at Barnes & Noble to pick up Matthew McConaughey's new book. Very exciting times. But update on my North Park experience for the first time in, what, eight months? Um, it was 10 out of 10. The Barnes and we walked around for a bit. Green lights is sold out, so we couldn't get it. I'm just gonna order it on Amazon, which I should have done days ago, but I just always wanted to go pick it up. It's fine. I want the physical copy too. 
<laughs> it's very important. You want the look of it. Yeah, I need the look of it. I need it just like, I need it. You need it. the hard copy. Exactly. So, that's what we're doing. I'm back home. It is, I think it's like 4 p.m. Yeah, 4.15. Saturday night, and all I want to do is clean my house. So, that is the plan. I mean, it's like, it is clean, but I want to deep clean, and I need to deep clean like my bathtub and things like that. So, nothing too fun or exciting. I actually really need to... Maybe I'll try to do that tomorrow. I need to switch my doorknob still. And that is like a whole ordeal. But anyways, I want to show you guys when I got them all. Time for a little anthro haul. I just got two things. One of them's really big. The first thing I got is just this little notebook. I'm not obsessed with the design, but I love the feel of this for some reason. I am like a journal junkie and I just haven't really been able to like focus lately or really focus on my devos the past few days. And I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna get a new journal and go from there. So that is my plan. Um, and that honestly actually does help me even if it's like stupid. The next thing I got is this blanket that is so cool. I'm about to clean my couch, but this blanket is, well, I hope that I like it with this couch. Yeah, I do. But I mean, honestly, it's really weird. I'm gonna have to play around with it. And if not, I'll put it elsewhere, but I wanted, a new blanket for downstairs and it doesn't look absolutely incredible with my couch but I'll figure it out and it's just this really interesting like almost blue hued brown blanket but it also looks black or gray my house is a lot of browns and a lot of blacks it's kind of very masculine so that was kind of the idea behind this and I just thought it was fun you know what I really want guys if you guys have seen Kendall Jenner's architectural digest video where she has that neon sign in her living room I think or maybe it's her bedroom I don't know, but it's really cool. I want one of those that says like, you can go to hell and I'll go to Texas or whatever that saying is for like the, my kitchen wall where I just got that new art piece for her, but I want it over there so bad. I would have to get it made and it would be so expensive, but that is like my dream piece for that area. So updates to come guys. I've also been thinking about getting rid of the rug and going rugless in my living area, which I might actually just do today and see how I like it. I'm just gonna roll up the rug and see. I just want things to be like a little bit more minimal, I think. Oh, also, I got a new puzzle. This was sent to me. They actually sell these in Anthropology, so they were right next to the um, like Monopoly sets that we were showing you guys, but it's this new brand. Actually, I don't know if they're new, but they're new to me, called Piecework Puzzles, and they have like the coolest puzzles and I feel like I'm gonna be really into puzzles in the holiday season. I feel like my face is so puffy right now. I don't know why but and I just think it is the coolest thing ever. So I want to actually start doing that. I might do that like tomorrow. I want to have like a really chill cozy day. Thank you guys so much. This is also this is also like a really good gift. Oh wait I forgot I picked up something at Urban. So I got this top which is so cozy guys. Like I feel like I will wear this 24 7 with sweats or even with jeans or whatever pants like it is just so soft I can't even describe to you how soft it actually feels but it is like my new favorite top guys love this my style is really more like Cameron Diaz in the holiday like long sweaters Uggs jeans like things that I like didn't think I would go back to but like here we are you know Okay guys, Gilmore Girls is blasting downstairs, but I have just been cleaning my room, deep cleaning, deep cleaning my bathroom. I just showered after doing that. I just scrubbed this tub, so I'm gonna let this be for right now, but I feel so good. I'm listening to Kanye West with Joe Rogan on at my TV. I also just got out of the shower and I self-tanned. So like a hair mask, really just kind of going through the whole routine. All right guys, I just did like a two hour long Devo, so it is a crazy Saturday night um, in my house. I'm about to take the dogs on their last walk and then I'll probably read and just watch shows for the rest of the night. So I will see you guys in the morning, but before I end off the vlog for tonight. But guys, this candle smells so good. I will have it linked below. It is so good. I cannot get over it. Good morning, everyone.
everyone, it's Sunday morning. I have just been up. I did my Devo and reading, which I'll talk about later because I feel like in the past, like, what, 12 hours? I've learned so much, so we will chat soon. I was cleaning my couch last night, so I just let it dry. I've had the door open all day. And here is my new blanket, guys, which I'm kind of a little bit changing the vibe, I think, of the downstairs area. Probably in January because like Christmas obviously will be going up like next week And so that'll be Christmas and then when we're done I'm gonna make it look a little bit more fun I think which will be really easy to do but this blanket is the first thing at first I was like I don't know about it, but I Absolutely love it and it is perfect for the new vibe and imagine guys like It's just fun. Okay, so imagine this cool great blanket here and then over here We have like a really cool custom neon sign and then, you know, we will be getting the kitchen stuff fixed. I actually might go to the store today to pick out new counters. I need to do that, actually. See, um, my fans came in, but I'm not going to have them set up yet. Co Fitz, wait, why are you eating Coco's food? He does this all the time. Let's go eat your own. Let's go eat your own food right here. Thank you. So weird. Anyways, it is a beautiful Sunday morning. I think I'm actually going to take Fitz on a walk. I'm going to take just him this morning because I've been taking them both together, but... I'm still working on leash training him, and he's trying to eat her. I really love taking a really long walk, listening to a podcast or music, grabbing coffee. It's just like the best thing to do in the morning, so that's what I'm going to do. I also, this morning, guys, I scheduled every single workout Monday through Friday for this week so that I will be doing it. I'm doing like a mix of different workouts, but I just really need to be back on my game where I'm working out every day and I feel like I've just been way less consistent. So this week I've scheduled all my workouts because that way I'll actually do it if it's in my calendar and I've just been planning my week. I have a little bit of work to do today, so we will be doing that. But today is just kind of like getting my life together, planning for the week, prepping for the week. I need to also, I guess, do food. I'll probably do that tomorrow. I already cleaned my entire house last night, like deep cleaned, so I feel really good. It's the best feeling waking up to a clean house on a Sunday morning. Okay, update. I love the rugless look. Ignore the dog's treats that they've messed up. Okay, if it's already chewing on my blanket. He literally looks so cute. I can't get over it. Anyways, I love the blanket. It is so cool. He quickly went and got his bone from his crate to just make a mess on my couch. So. You know, Fitz, this is why I have to clean my couch 24-7. Just got a black coffee with a splash of oat milk from the merchant. And then, first off, their bags are so cute. I got a little cinnamon roll, which is like shaped like a muffin. Wow. Okay, I had it heated up and I just messed that up, but it looks so good. I'm back from my walk. I feel really good. I was gone for about 45 minutes and it was just so incredible. I really highly recommend going on long walks in the morning. Anyways, I need to drink my coffee because I couldn't actually drink it because Fitz has been crazy, guys. Like, he's getting worse on the leash and he used to be like perfect. His training starts next week, so it's fine, but. What do you guys do? Because he used to never bark at other dogs. He was really good. And now he's like crazy when he sees another dog. And now he's talking about it. Give me tips down below. He is going to training, but still. So I did my makeup and I'm actually going to do my hair now. I just got literally the best news ever. I just called like 15 people. Anyways, I'm going to do my hair with my Dyson Airwrap. I'm going to be honest, guys. I have really still not mastered the art of the Dyson Airwrap. Like Mariana Hewitt, how does she do that? I don't know. So I have like the whole kit here, which I really do like it. And the main reason that I think I don't use it 24-7 is because I still haven't gotten the plugs replaced in my bathroom so they don't work right now. Dyson was also kind enough to send me these two accessories, which I haven't used yet. I'm gonna use the 30 millimeter. They also sent me the 40 millimeter. These are new. These are basically just like accessories for the air app that you can buy extra. But when you buy the air app originally, like I'll have it linked down below. It is pricey, but like keep in mind, it replaces like every hair tool that you have essentially. And it's really so much better for your hair. So anyways, it comes with all those tools, but Dyson has a few extra now. Oh wait, oh, duh. I forgot you have to have two because there's a left and a right one. So like I said, I'm not a pro at this, so um, bear with me, everyone. So I'm gonna start with this piece. I cannot wait to go even lighter with my hair. I'm having so much fun being blonde. I 
I think I like this one better already because that's exactly the size of the curl that I want. I am giving this like a 20 out of 10. First off, they're the exact like curls and wave size that I like as is, but also it took four minutes to do like my entire head and I just love it. Like it's actually perfect. Okay, I'll have that link down below, but I love this one. My favorite one, again, it's a 30 millimeter. Also, I got these headbands. I'm not gonna be wearing this. I just put this shirt on to curl my hair, but I got these headbands off Amazon because I have been loving the headband trend lately i don't know if i love them on me i always try it and then i just don't love it um i probably won't love it with this shirt that's for sure but i will link this below it was like 15 dollars, and it came with like six different headbands or something like that because i just like there's something about headbands on me that just like it doesn't look good update on the headband i do like it when it's just all the way back better i don't know if i like love it with this outfit look but we will see. I actually, I'm feeling like really chatty. Normally on weekends, I wouldn't film a video aside from like a vlog, but I really feel like I want to do like a Q&A. So I asked you guys for questions on Instagram. Go follow my Instagram. Also, I just, I don't know. I feel like I'm just in a really good mood. So I wanted to film a little Q&A, which will be up soon after this video or before or whatever. But I So I just filmed a q and I'm going to import that footage. I need to answer some emails um, from my editor, but also, and I also need to plan out my week, which I already did earlier when I planned out my, like, when I planned out like my workouts and stuff, but I wanna plan out what I'm eating so I can order some groceries. And then also I need to figure out how to import my Passion Planner Digital into my iPad, because for some reason I'm having so much trouble with it like it will not import and i've looked up so many videos and done stuff but i'm determined today to figure it out and then hopefully i'll be able to show you guys the whole situation all right guys i made a bonza pizza it is my last one that i have Ooh, that was my keurig these are so good so this is the third one that i'm trying it's like the four cheese one but anyways it's 2 30 I don't have anything until six and I need to get work done. So that is what I'm gonna do. I think I'm actually gonna go upstairs because I need to charge my phone and like get a bunch of stuff situated. I need to plan for a podcast tomorrow. Normally I try to not leave any of this up until the weekend, but that's just not how this week worked out. So gotta get that stuff together. I actually got really lucky. I didn't realize that I had actually already planned out a few of the things that I Thought I had to do so that's really good news. It is 4 p.m. I'm watching church from home at 6 I kind of think I'm going to take like a nice bubble bath I can't decide and like maybe read do some great skincare all of that stuff I love my room and how it's been looking out of the shower My hair is just up in a bun and it looks crazy but update on the Dyson curls I was just looking at them again, and it's like everything I've ever wanted in a curl Ever and I know there's a Sephora sale coming up and I'm pretty sure that Dyson is excluded from the sale But if not, there's a Sephora sale coming up and it's 20% off So come back to this vlog get the link come back to this vlog if that's the case I'll have everything linked down below that I use but it is just so good Also speaking of if you guys have a like to know it if you guys or if you don't have a like to know it You guys need to download the app and then you can follow me at Kenzie Elizabeth. It's really addicting because you find all these like really good deals and sales and stuff But that's where I link everything. So if you guys want outfits if you want direct links to anything in my house um, Drinks I have at home or I make from home like things like that everything is on the app So you guys should go download it anyways I'm just having the coziest little afternoon. Well, it's really like almost five now, but I feel so good Okay, guys, I'm going to end off this weekend on my life vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it If you guys did let me know by giving it a thumbs up Subscribe if you're new here. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.